Um, right then. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Little Wolsey on it. <laughs> yeah. Great little car. The first Mini, the prototype Mini, looked like that. Is that right? Had a front very similar to that, um, with a Mini, but no boot, Mini back end or something, that sort of um, Anyway, um, don't see too many of them. <laughs> they should have known, but they don't hit the spot like a Mini. For whatever reason, like an Austin or a Morris, they just don't do it. And I can't understand why, because they're a luxurious version of a Mini. Everyone should be clamouring for them. But we've had a couple of nice little Riley Elfs and the odd Woolsey on it over the last two or three years. They've not done that well, really. I'm quite surprised. You know, and they should do. I just cannot understand why they don't do a lot better business than what they actually do. Um, but this is a lovely little car, isn't it? Bright little thing. Real and money. White little tires. Yeah, they actually are. They are actually white ones and all by the looks of it. Yeah, they're not I thought they were flats, yeah. But no, it's a, it's a right honest looking little car, isn't it? Really it nice. Is. I feel how nice it is under there. It's quite nice and tidy, quite nice and straight. And uh, yeah, they're all right. Yeah, they're all right. All the skins and that are nice. Nice little car, bonny little motor. Yeah, it's the right bright little thing. Motor litre steering wheel, as you can see. A little bit of wood trim around the... Uh, centre console and what have you, which is it's lovely, it's attractive it's a little motor. It's a smiley car, I just yeah, drove in it, it and is, drove it yeah. off and I couldn't help but sort of smile <laughs> really, I really like it. Funny little sun visor which sort of, yeah, you, just, you see I like little bits like that. Oh uh, yeah, I do, I like sun visors in general but I suppose that's about the only sun visor you're going to get for a, for a Mini, I've never seen one with a, with a sun visor so that, that's uh, <laughs> unusual to say the least. I personally would have it off, but anyway, it's each to his own. But um, I, I like these little bits of piece of chrome trims on these that were always, always sort of standout points and air vents and such like that. What a clean little engine bay. Really nice bonny little car. Yeah, lovely little clean engine. Does it sound all right? Lovely mint, yeah. Yeah, nice little thing. I bet that lights up. I bet it does. <laughs> I bet it does. It's one of them that... Um, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it does as well, yeah. Yes, yeah. <laughs> there you go, look at her, look. Fantastic. Always tell a Woolsey coming down the road. Yeah, yeah. But they were the only vehicle that had a light there. Is that right? Uh, I, there might be a lot more in these days. Uh, I, I don't know, or, you know, in the 60s and 70s possibly, or what, I don't know. But I can't remember one. But in the 30s, whenever you saw a badge like that coming down the road, or you saw a 30s car coming down the road, that was a Woolsey. It's, uh, I think it's lovely, lovely little car. Yeah, really nice little thing. Someone to have a lot of fun with that. A lot of fun with it. Definitely. Once the original steering wheel put back on, get rid of that. Get rid of the visor. Get rid of the white walls. And you've got a right bonny little car. <laughs> nice little thing. Good. Turn them round. That's the best thing to do. Just turn them round. Yeah. The white wood on the inside. That's the best place for them. But nice, lovely little car. Nice little thing. Good. Cool